Hi guys, this is Crystal. So I thought it would be fun to do like a retired ABG look. This is an OG ABG, okay? She's a veteran at Coachella. She's been many times before, but she's coming out of retirement because it's the first Coachella in so many years and she just wants to have a little bit of fun. Okay, this is what I think she would wear to Coachella and we're really going for comfort. Oh my God. That's the ABG's husband's ricer out there. She is just trying to be comfortable. She knows that it is hot, you get sweaty, you wanna wear the most comfortable shoes, and I have so much respect for her. And that is why I am honoring her today. So let's just dive right into it. It is so hot today. Priming my face with my unseen sunscreen per usual. I think today I will start with my eyes again. Just priming my lids here. Let's do my brows first. When I think about the ABG, I think that she has like pretty strong brows. So I'm gonna use this Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Powder Duo. I'm just gonna go in and kind of like fill in my brows with the brush. I'm just gonna use a angled brush, the darker color for the tail. And then I'm using the lighter color to fill in the front of the brow. A lot darker. Okay, now I am gonna use some concealer to just kind of like carve out the brows. Take my Pat McGrath concealer, make a concealer brush. This is one from Bare Minerals. And I'm just gonna go right under my brow. Now I'm just gonna take a sponge and blend that out. Now I'm gonna do my eyeshadow. I'm actually gonna go into my Naked palette, this Naked color right here to hollow out my lids. And this will be kind of like the transition color. We're gonna use this color from the Jaclyn Hill palette. Sweep that all over the lid underneath where I just placed that transition shade. Now I'm gonna go back into the Naked color from earlier and kind of blend everything out. Make sure there are no harsh lines. Pretty much done with the eyeshadow. Now I'm gonna go in with my Stila. I just picked up a new one from the Sephora sale. I'm just gonna do like a pretty standard wing. Alrighty, next I'm gonna do need a little bit of highlight right here. I'm gonna take my Bobbi Brown Shimmer Brick, use a little fluffy brush, and then I'm just going in the inner corner of my eye. I'm also gonna take a little bit of this um, Vermeer color in my Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette. That is a mouthful. And I'm just gonna use a tiny little brush like this and highlight this in the corner a little bit more. We're just gonna do the rest of my face now. I'm gonna go with something more high coverage because I feel like that is just the ABG way. So I'm just gonna use some of my Dior Backstage Foundation and I'm just gonna take my sponge. Now I'm just taking my NARS concealer and covering up some of my scarring and my Pat McGrath. I have 
this huge scab on my forehead because I just got a facial the other day. Let's see, let's try to cover it up. I'm just using my finger to kind of blend the concealer that's around it. We're just gonna let that chill. Wow, that's a lot of powder. I did not mean to do that. Look how much I poured out. I'm gonna take a sponge and I'm gonna try to bake my under eye. for a little bit. Next we're gonna do some light contouring. So I'm just taking my Fenty Beauty bronzer and then just taking my fluffy brush and gonna contour. I'm gonna contour under my lip as well. I'm gonna take my bronzing brush and just bronze up the face. So I think the concealer is pretty much set now. So I'm gonna set that with some powder and then I'm gonna set the rest of my face as well. I'm gonna let that sit for a little bit. I'm gonna use this NARS blush and this is in the color Deep Throat. And then I'm just gonna concentrate that back here. I'm gonna Use this big fluffy brush and just kind of go over my entire face and make sure everything is like super blended. And then now I think I'm gonna do a little bit of color on my under eye, just a little bit. I'm gonna take the naked color and then use my tiny fluffy brush for that. I'm gonna go in with a small pencil brush with that brown color from the Jaclyn Hill palette, just to kind of darken that a little bit. Now I'm gonna go in with my Shimmer Brick Highlight. My face, just on the bridge of the nose, a little bit on the tip, and a little bit on the high points of my cheek. All right, so I'm gonna curl my lashes first. I'm gonna tight line my upper lid really quick. I'm gonna use this like small Marc Jacobs eyeliner sample that I got. And we're gonna do lashes now. Let's see which one's more ABG. I feel like maybe this one's better. Yeah, let's use this one. So far I really like this lash glue. I've been using it for probably like a month now definitely has a pretty strong hold. I think I want a little bit more blush. For my lips, I'm gonna try this new lip pencil that I just got from Sephora. This is the Charlotte Tilbury lip liner, and it's like in this nude color, which I think is perfect. And I'm definitely gonna overline my lips. that is pretty much the makeup look. I'm gonna blow dry my hair straight, so I'm gonna do that off camera. Now that I'm done blow drying my hair, I do wanna add one small touch. This is like so old school. So I'm just gonna take this tiny brush and I'm gonna go into my shimmer brick and a tiny bit of highlight right under my arch. Okay, I'm gonna put on the full outfit and then we'll take a look at everything together. And this is a final look. I honestly love an ABG look. It's always really pretty and it is all in the lashes. Definitely put on the most dramatic pair of lashes you own and this is it, this is the look. All right, let me show you guys my outfit. I have to put on my shoes. Oh, hi. <laughs> so this is the final look. I've got a big Tupac shirt on, some biker shorts, and some sneakers. This like Cuban link chain, I put on the biggest pair of hoops that I own. To finish off the outfit, I stole my husband's bag. That is the look, you guys.
Super comfy, super low key. This concludes my Coachella series and I hope you guys have enjoyed it. I've had a really fun time just creating all these looks for you. Please do let me know in the comments which one was your favorite. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. That